Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is going to be a, hopefully the shortest video I've ever made. And it might be uh, really elementary for some of you, but I had somebody watch the how to create a rope border fast and easy, and he kept, he, he was confused about the, you know, how to get this to move over a certain amount. And he said, well, when I duplicate, then it's, it, um, uh, moves it over and I, it's already marked and I can't do anything with it. So I've drawn a two inch circle. So there's two things and, and, and this is one thing that confuses a lot of people and it confused me at first. When you're clicked on an item, uh, what you need to look at is going away. So you need to click off the item and we're going to look at these two boxes. One of them is your nudge distance. I keep mine set on 0 .001 which is really minute but uh, moving around and then this is your duplicate distance and this is where I think he's got it set on like 0.25 by 0.25 which is standard or default so if you have you need to really set, well you don't need to I like this set at 00 because then when you go when you click on the item and you make control D it's put a copy right on top of the other one then you can do things like double click on it get your rotation put it in the center of the screen and like other videos it didn't look like it went to the center that it did so let's put 30 of these things around no well let's put 30 but let's make them 12 degrees will fit 30 control D again we'll make it 24 degrees control D and then you've drawn these circles all the way around so I think that's what he's confused about. And the difference is, unless you get one of these back, is your duplicate distance. If you want this, and like here again, it's, it's gone. So you need to click off of it. If you want to put these circles side by side, this is where you want to put two inches because your circle's two inches. So now you're going to make control D and then move over your arrow key one time, control D, and you'll just keep putting them exactly two inches apart. Anyway, I hope that helps and hope that helped him understand what's going on. So I hope that helped and thank you for watching.